my next video of the day, since we are touching on grooming fish, um, I get asked a lot, what can I do to grow my, like that one, see he's got the, some white patches on there. What can I do to increase wen growth? So I was just talking about how I don't like to over push fish, but giving Aranda's a slightly higher protein um, can help boost wen growth. So I wouldn't push it on a massive scale, like I said, because that high fat, high protein is going to cause issues. But giving them um, slightly higher brine shrimp, blood worm protein can help grow the wen. Now, is that a good thing? Like this guy here? I could, I could probably boost his wen growth, not a problem. The problem is, is there used to be Randas. You don't see them as much now. There used to be Randas that had huge wen growth and then you would end up with these fish with swim bladder issues because their head was so heavy they would tilt down butt up um or their wen would completely grow and cover their eyes i had one many years ago that i trimmed it the wen does not wen is kind of like very fatty tissue in that you know there is some blood supply connecting directly to the head but there's not really blood supply going through the whole wen that's why I said if you see redness in a wen, that's when you know you have issues because it's bleeding from underneath. So you can trim wen if you have to. Um, not really advisable to take a sharp object to your fish ever because, you know, they can flop around. But the quality of life when a fish's eyes are completely grown over, I think is a little bit less. So I don't prefer to have massive wen growth on my arandas. I like just the simple, simple wen. So that way they're not um, swim bladder affected, they're not balance affected, they're not um, growing over their eyes and having problems seeing. So if you have to boost your wen, arandas wen growth, some extra protein, but always in moderation.